Okay, so I didn't die, that's good. What's going on? Ah, he's finally come to. And he can speak human, turns out. Started thinking I'm not conversing common the whole way. Except maybe with my reflection in the piss bucket. Where... Where am I? Is that a boat? Or the fuck bath oil. It's that strange tone, is it? En route to a fear. Don't remember signing on as a sailor. <laughs> oh, you didn't, mate. They dragged you aboard. Seems you killed that prince. Shit, <laughs> means I'm in trouble. Oh, toad in the sewers. Damn it. Should consider myself lucky, I guess. Could have killed me on the spot. Depends how you look at it. Happen to know a bit of a theory. Heard them saying they come here on a mission, dispatched by the king to find their prince, lift his curse. That Waited sucks. their honor, and that of their families five generations back, that they'd bring him home safe and sound. And I killed him. Great. So, must think they can save their honor by bringing the prince's murderer back to face the king's justice. <laughs> Why are you here? You kill a prince too. Well, to their thinking, why the hand of this death? See, I was their guide. Led them down into the sewers. But not until after you'd caught their prince's gut. Sorry about that. Not your fault, mate. When all said and done, I could have sat on my ass in the alchemy playing Gwen. Didn't have to brag about knowing Oxenford better than me own breeches. I forgot about the quaint. We been at sea long? Uh, Dunno, Riley. Not that long. Though, on the other hand... <laughs> but what's it matter, any road? Matters a lot. If they're hauling me off to hang me, I'm not in a hurry to arrive. Me? I'm glad to be silent to a fear. I hear they got wild horses there. White, black stripes... The zebras. Always wanted to see them. Sure they're not. Black horses with white stripes. <laughs> hey, black horses with white stripes, they got in Sanguibar. That I'm sure of. Listen, there was a young woman, a medic, red hair. They capture her too? I don't recall seeing anyone of the sort. You were alone. Good. Means she managed to flee. Hopefully made it home. Tried to break out yet? Uh, used every ounce of charm I got. Nothing doing. Might be my Aferi's, Rusty. My Aferi's non-existent. Well, we'll be at sea at least a month. Teach us in that time. Elkal! Orial! What's that mean? I told us to shut up. There's been a misunderstanding. Can I talk to you, Captain? Elkal Sorkan! Galavan Kar! U Albata Agel! Quiet, dog. You killed our prince. Pay for that. Gilea Bala Carvarepader. He'd be dead already. Rev Hag, the Aram Ekans, the Aram to read. Dorgate the Alami. We swore on him. How do I say? Take me to your captain. Vilf, Alache, or Egulath. What? Elkal. Vilf. Vilf. What did I say? What just happened? What did he say? Said to sit quiet. I thought you'll hang in two weeks. Great. Give it a rest. No point talking to that body. All you get is angry gurgles. And they puff up, and notice, while them fish. What's it called? Is there anyone here who speaks common? Ah, oh, there's this mercenary with him. Looks a Danian to me. He's the one recruited me to show him through the sewers. Oh, and the mage, what leads them, knows a bit. Heard him talking. I doubt either will talk to you. Uh, I was you. Catch some short eye. I'll go on flapping my tongue. I've got a long voyage ahead. <laughs> Sleep's not what I need. Someone I could actually communicate with. That's what I want. 
Greetings, Geralt. Remember me? I don't. Not really. Gaunter Odin, known also as Master Mirror. We bet in White Orchard. I helped you find your Yennefer. We meet again. And it seems you need my help again. Heard a noose awaits you. That is, if this slot doesn't kill you first. Hmm. Haven't tried it yet. It doesn't look promising. Not unlike your situation. I could try to extract you from here, you know. Because you do wish to disembark, do you not? I do, yeah, sure. But what on earth could you? Oh, more than you'd ever expect. I shall help you, Geralt. But before I do, I must know you return favor. Right. Can't possibly get something for nothing. Indeed. When all said and done, I am a merchant. So, do you want my help? Yes. It's a deal. Once it's all over, we shall meet at midnight at the crossroads, meet the willows near the village of Yantra. Ah, and I must give you something to remember me by. What the fuck? What's that? A mark to show we're associates. Jesus. Who are you gabbing with? With no one. Oh, never like boats. Not one bit. I heave like devils. Make me stump and churn. Oh, give me prime to sleep through the whole thing. <laughs> To a fear, get us safe. The king's reward will be generous. What about the prisoner? Before the king, we must bring him. On doing so, my honor relies. Can we just bring your king the bastard's head? Like we do with the other? Other drop. We do nothing. We deliver lie this one. Apart from all else, the hell the king is sure to condemn him to. What kind of hell? Harry, flaying, 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 How do I beat him?
Holy shit. What's in his chest? here. Interesting. Is there a way I could get my stuff back? I would really want to get my stuff back. Oh, look at all these fuckers. Let's fuck them up. My sword fucking sucks. Sorry, guys. stash I have a bunch of swords there and other clothes I guess need to find a signpost first oops to unbind this. We just do that. Cat. Fucking cat man. Not so fast, Roach. This 
too bright. Too, too bright. I knew you'd come. You're a soothsayer? It matters little who I am. Your escape, I made it possible. Previously, Yennefer, you found her thanks to me, so you feel you owe me. <laughs> the memento you gave me, pretty effective reminder. That is its purpose. Incidentally, I find it quite funny how even the most rotten scoundrels have this inner compunction to repay Debts of gratitude. Humans, elves, dwarves, all races. You really must explain that to me one day. As for the here and now, tell me, how'd you manage with your feelings? You appeared out of nowhere, disappeared just as mysteriously, summoned a storm. Let me guess, you're a mage. Oh, please, no. I cannot stand spells. Hmm. Childish hocus pocus. It's just not interesting. What I find fascinating are true tales, true human lives, like the one I shall tell you now. It's about a man, worse than most. A vulgar, despicable man with a heart of stone. A man who refuses to pay his debts. Really think this will interest me? Any reason why? He's wronged you as well. His name is Olgierd von Everick. Sit here. How do you know we'd met, and that I'm not exactly thrilled with him now? Please, Geralt. I knew the Ophiri had captured you. Was I not to know how this had come to pass? Olgierd von Everick did willfully and maliciously conspire to cause you to kill a man who might have been cured. Had I not intervened, you would have lost your head for this. Do you know why he did it? Because he's a degenerate monster in human flesh who feeds on the pain and suffering of others. Well, you clearly don't like him. What did he do to you? He and I made a pact. A pact under which I called on my many talents and associates to give him what he desired. Now the time's come to pay, yet he shirks his obligation. Need me to collect a debt? I'm not some hired muscle. Muscle is not what this requires. It needs a soul intelligent and clever. An individual who fears no dare. Someone like you. Pure flattery, that. Of course it is. After all, I am a traveling merchant. But make no mistake. Many interesting wares on offer. Wares like? Surfeit. Abundance for the body and soul. You will lack neither food nor drink. As a witcher, you might desire weapons supreme. I can offer you those you dreamt of. Your body, agile as never before. Your mind, faster than lightning. Romantic prowess to charm all womankind. experience like no other the fate of only the chosen few sure sounds generous and all that for my help with one small matter won't want anything else from me just one honesty kind of sus what did you do for old geared break him out of a cell too in some sense yes i remember that day quite it was a light drizzle, yet the cold tore right through you. Olgierd appeared at the break of dawn. 
gaunt as a rail. His shirt, mothy. Seemed to have naught but the sword at his side. It quite pained me to look at him. He asked for help. And help I gave. Made him a rich man. Successful. Esteemed. He is who he is today, thanks only to me. And yet afterwards, he turned his back. Shunned me. Sends me off when I dare ask for payment. Even sicked his hounds on me once. He's thus left me no option but to invoke the terms of our pact. And that is where you come in. Hmm. How much does he owe you? <laughs> Gentlemen, don't discuss coin. Need to know the details if you want me to get my hands dirty. How much? A million crowns? Two million? I'm no usurer to lend coin for interest. No. What Olgird owes me is far more personal than shiny things that clink. As much as I regret it, I can say no more. I must respect his privacy. But you want to kill him. What about you? Call yourself a man of many talents? Can't you take care of this? Therein lies the catch. Our pact states that before I can collect my due, I must yet fulfill three wishes for Von Everick, but I cannot fulfill them myself directly, making use instead of a... Hmm, how shall I put it? A proxy. Mm -hmm. So what you need's a sucker. What I need is an ally. And something tells me I shall find none better than you. That's true. What do you expect me to do? To start with, join me in paying Von Everick a visit. Then, well... Then we shall improvise. Sure. I believe, however, that all will end well. And once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. Right. Specifics now. Thought Old Geard had three wishes, requests, whatever. Uh, he does. He may ask three things of us. Yet we won't know what they are until we see him. Seems a little shady. Your help, your pact with Old Geard, his three requests. Think it over. I agree, you've no a priori reason to trust me. But, as it happens, I was in the right place at the right time to help you. And it's also the case that the same man has wronged us both. To my mind, those are reasons to work together. To my mind, not so much. Come with me to see Old Geard. You shall see he's a vile, dishonorable man who treats the lives of all folk like playthings, as he treated yours when he sent you to find the Frog Prince. Sure. Fine. I'll go see Olgird with you, but no promises. That is all I ask. Now remove the damn mark. Naturally. Just as soon as you complete your task. Go. You will not regret it. We shall meet there. I have a matter to attend to along the way. Another debt to collect? This guy, Perhaps. This guy is so sus, man. So sus. We'll see all good. Okay. Fine. I'd like to do this. I have a feeling this one will like fail <coughs> if I don't do it. So let's do that one first. So I can remove this from the map. I don't really need it anymore. Oh, roach. Perfect. Faster. Oh. I'm 
abandoned site. Okay, I'll clear those out later, of course. I'm done to do some quests now. Ghouls. Let's fuck them up. Here. Smells of. Uh, they were cooking Fistech. Took most of the equipment, only left what was broken. Open window. Boot print on the bed. Somebody was in a hurry. True as true can be. Dangerous trade narcotics. Mate, you keep your eyes peeled wide open. Someone's taking an interest in your work. They're gonna make an offer, you're not gonna be able to refuse. Nice reference. Juice, I'll pack it up and go hide somewhere. Oh, yeah. Cool. Uh, is there anything else here? No. Let's go around the hut then. For a second, hid, then ran on. Scar on his forehead. Must be Clivert. Bolt in the back. Went in deep, so a close range shot. From the village, what that direction looks like. Something. Crossbow bolt and footprints deep. Shooter must have been wearing heavy armor. Flying there. It's not a fucking plane, that's for sure. Oh, 
Oh my god. The Wombo Combo. So where did I see this one thingy? some of these to regenerate a bit faster. Turn, 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 turn. Hello, gentlemen. I just watched the Furiosa a couple days ago. Is that a reference to that? Those uh, dudes called in white? stuff not important to me oh interesting that's why I will just run but the more a pack of common bandits are moving the main fish deck you cannot allow this I'm missing the only protective village extending the run of the sample sex and terror in my hearts okay wait that's it what's inside You're not roach. You are a roach. You know what? I should save. I didn't save him. I'm just passing through. We'll be back later. Let me save. Okay, maybe I can't save uh, on the horse. Never mind. Hello, gentlemen. Vagrant, don't know why you're here, but take my advice. Go back to wherever you came from. So, why are you still standing there? I need to smash your plate in. Good luck with that. Wondering what you got inside, because it reeks of fist tech to me. 
Mind if I have a look, brethren? <laughs> Aye, we'd mind. Very much so. Enough of these games. I'm counting to three, and you're gonna be gone when I'm done. Got it? One, two... <laughs> How would you like to count to a larger number using Novigrad crowns? That strike your fancy? Well, yeah, what do I care? <laughs> Go on in. Gentlemen. Well, that is big. What the fuck? Is there here someone? I'm a witcher, or as your brethren prefer to call me, a mutant, a freak. You shouldn't be in here. And Knights of the Flaming Rose shouldn't be murdering humans or producing drugs. True, we shouldn't. We're supposed to defend the downtrodden. Spread faith in the eternal fire. But Radovid tricked us. He broke his oath, sent our brethren to the front as common grunts, and once the mighty order was bled dry, he disbanded us. Took our lands, confiscated our domains to finance his war. The brethren who didn't object were appointed mage hunters. Those who took umbrage dared to stand up to him. They were imprisoned. We're but a handful who still wear the colors. And we must find a new place in this world. <laughs> so you turned rogue? That your idea? Wonder what Siegfried of Danell would say. Siegfried of Danell would... But how do you even... I know. You're Geralt of Rivia. Jacques de Aldersburg's killer. None other. And if I had to go back, I'd do it again. That was the start of our death. You were the beginning. A cursed mutant! Draw your blade! No need to yell. Just ask. <laughs> lightly. Okay. <laughs> Take the sniper first. Oh my god. Holy fuck. Uh. It's 
shall be over soon. Oh fuck, that was not in this time. Are there any of the big chests here? I, I don't really want their daggers, fucking useless. Easy. These two are escape, I guess. Hopefully, there is a signpost like nearby or something. that later Sup? Avenged your friend. <laughs> I knew you'd succeed, puss peepers. I knew it. Go on, out with it. Who was the bastard? Bastards. Brethren of the Order of the Flaming Rose. <laughs> what did you do to them? Scald them with hot irons, pick out their eyes, Jesus. skin them alive. No, just killed them. Oh, so handsome and so boring. Here, puss peeps, your gold. Ought to be enough for an ounce of panache. Cool. Alright, uh, let me save. 